In the world of satellite equipment, there are many different models of satellite antennas, motor hangers and receivers. Installation of a motor hanger to a satellite antenna from a satellite receiver needs a bit more requirements than in case of an azimuth antenna. So when you purchase a receiver, first of all, you need to pay attention to whether it supports working under DISEQC 1.2 protocol. Without this, the satellite receiver will simply not be able to manage the motor hanger. DISEQC 1.2 is a motorized hanger, controlled via DISEQC 1.2 protocol. Setting up the antenna's turning is arranged first to the geostationary south and the place where you are installing the antenna. When the elevation angle and declination are set with the remote control of the receiver, the satellite antenna is gradually rotated until the signal from the satellite appears. After this, the position is saved in the card memory or the motor hanger's position. The same operation is also carried out for other selected satellites. Thus, each position remains in the memory. Later on, when you select the desired channel belonging to any previously recorded satellite, the motor hanger already automatically moves the satellite antenna to the previously memorized position. As a rule, if a satellite receiver supports the DISEQC 1.2 protocol, it also has a mode for automatic positioning of the satellite, USALS. This mode is somewhat similar to the DISEQC 1.2 protocol. In principle, the USA LC function is like a useful addition and not obligatory, but it saves you the trouble of manual search for the positions of each desired satellite. For example, if for any reason you have reset the receiver to factory settings or have reflashed the software, you have to set the positions of each satellite once again. With the USALS function, it will be enough to enter one's latitude and the longitude coordinates of your locality, and if necessary, the satellite longitude and then the satellite antenna will itself take the necessary position. When you choose the satellite receiver to control the motor hanger, be sure to take into account the current characteristics of the power supply of the receiver. This power supply is used not only for all the internal electronics of the receiver, it is also necessary to ensure the normal operation of the converter and, consequently, the motor hanger. This means that this parameter directly influences the adequate response of the motor hanger to the commands of your satellite receiver. You can learn the current characteristics of the satellite receiver from its certificate. The necessary line in the certificate looks like this. Herewith, L and B is a contact socket to plug the converter or the converter with the motor hanger, that is, in principle, the satellite antenna itself. 13.0 plus minus 0.5 volt is a voltage of the converter, which is applied during its work in the vertical polarization, in case of a line converter, or the right-hand polarization, in case of a circle converter. 18 plus slash minus 0.7 volt is a voltage of the converter, which is applied during its work in the horizontal polarization, in case of a line converter, or the left-hand polarization, in case of a circle converter. Max 400 mA indicates maximum current load of the L and B input, which can be created by the converter connected to it, or the total current load of the converter with the motor hanger.